Ooh. We're at Highland Hills today. We're going to be playing nine holes. This is my first time at this course. Um, we're going to be doing a normal nine, nine hole round here today, but I'm going to be busting out the tilt and trying to show you guys how useful it can be in its intended purposes. Uh, I know I've seen a couple of videos of people doing the tilt only challenge, but I can't throw this thing that far and it'll be ugly. So. Hole one here is about 309, 310 feet. Is it 309 feet? It's pretty much a, you gotta hit a little gap here, straight down the middle. I'm gonna try to hyzer flip a Svea because the left side looks a little scarier than the right side down there. So, let's give it a go. That's cooking a little bit right on me. Not bad. I gotta putt up the hill. It's probably like. 70 feet though. Alright, what are you throwing, bud? Just throwing this uh, gold River Pro. River Pro. He is a little bit left over there, so we'll have opposite shots. Look at this guy bringing his cart to the easiest course, probably in Northern Kentucky. All my discs are in here, and I don't know what's in the random bags I have in the trunk. I do realize this is a bit over. Okay. Excuses, excuses. Right, we we'll need we we'll need 30 discs for uh for nine holes. I will. I'm gonna throw 30 shots. Get up. About five feet, three feet. Now, what we have here is an Andrew in the wild. Look at the laser focus, the precision. Oh, he's got me confused. Oh, mate, he's put the wizard right in there. Get out. All right, we got both have tap ins here. And these baskets are absolutely awful. Look how old those are. Oh, we're gonna see some fun stuff today. Like I said earlier, guys, this is my first time here. So, that's hilarious. There's like 12 chains on this basket. All right, y'all, we both took part there on hole one. Hole two, short little ace run, 130 feet. I'm gonna throw a pig at it, give it a little flick. Um, try to throw it into the hill, that way if I, if I miss a little long, I'm not boned for my two. Uh, let's do it. Ooh. I hung it way left and it'll be tough. Headwind picked up on us right when he threw it. Alright, that's where Brody landed, as usual, down the hill, 50 feet away. He says as he's 50 feet away up the hill. Up the hill, yeah. I'm more like 70 feet. Oh, so close. You almost hit all six chains on this. Okay, I'm gonna film the walk of shame from him since he talks so much smack. Funny part is, I know his putting's been off the rack last couple days. So this is a big talk from this man's. Yep, he's got a tester coming back, folks. Missed my foot, but got the three. Bro, I'm freezing right now. My hand is freezing. Do I feel you? My fingertips are gonna fall off. Oh man. Uh, not a good hole. The elusive Berdogi. Alright, y'all, on this one, it says it's 267, uh, but it plays really far uphill. And the ground's kind of soggy, so I'm gonna throw a driver and try to stick it close. Uh, I just realized on hole one, I completely blew an opportunity to throw that tilt. So we're gonna have to try to do that soon. Hopefully not on this hole. I wanna, maybe I'll putt with it. That's short. Yeah. Yeah, it plays a lot further. I feel like a grandma. All right, Andrew's going destroyer here. He's going to be close. 
Yep, good skip too. Hello. Uh oh, sit down. Cool, I'm about three feet. Right here's Andrew's birdie shot. Oof. I really like that metal flake look it has. Yeah. Tapping in. Three's all around. Hilarious. I know. It's like nothing there. Go ahead. All right, guys. I think it's finally time. Uh, we got a little 170. It's actually around this tree. I'm gonna try to. Th this thing's highs or spikes into the ground. So if you try to really swing it wide, you're gonna miss wide right. Uh, let's just show you. Why am I talking? And it has flipped almost completely upside down. And it was short. It was short on a 170 foot downhill shot. That's what you get with that thing. Andrew takes the the correct route. He goes a little high, swings it all the way around, and he is just about parked. All right, so the tilt ended up not great. <laughs> I've got to throw this thing back in more. I've been doing it for some goofy shots. I'm about 55 feet, I'd say. I'll give it a bit. Oof. Oof. Bigger oof. Well, Brody, at least you get to practice your uh, 50 foot putts today. Yeah. Take two. This one's still about 35 feet. <laughs> Alright, dude. Yeah, it's not fun. It's a basket. Look at this basket. Check this out. Smack that. Check this out. The basket should not be able to move that much. <laughs> I feel for you. Alright, he's got to give the wizard its first taste of the chains. There we go. Oh, Good putt. And with that bird and me bogey we actually flip-flop uh, flip -flop the lead there. Two-stroke two swing, so Andrew gets the box. Alright, so it's not a destroyer. They're on the outside, I don't know how far it is. This one says it's a par 4. Um, it's around the woods here. Kind of boom. And uh, he caught a big tree up front, and he's gonna be down in that gully, guys. All right, I'm gonna be throwing the uh, the tour series lots. I don't think that I can get there all the way, so I just want to throw something real straight out to the right here. And I didn't at all. Could be worse. Down there or saving that's gonna be fun. Shot as you're gonna get here at Highland Hills. So yeah, he's got a eyes around there. Yep. I didn't roll, should be far. Yep, it looked good. So I gotta get oh shit. I gotta get a little crafty in here. Uh, yeah, I feel like you got a pair. See a basket on a hill. Not bad. Yeah, a putt from there. Long putt, but that's a good out from weird position. I should have threw a little more disc. Man, love the cage. I actually took a bit of an unexpected skip on us. I'm going to tap out real quick, guys. Okay. Here we go. Good three. And a basket caught it. That's how you do it, folks. Not Be more like Andrew, not like Brody. Hole six here, 275 feet. Plays a little bit uphill once again. I'm gonna try to throw this grim on a hyzer, kind of low-ish through this gap, and then push it, push it straight up there. Way too high again, boys. I got sneaky. Oh. And I'm way at the bottom of the hill. Andrew's gonna be ripping on an MVP motion. 
and plasma plastic for all those notes. He's gonna be up near the basket, a little bit short. I'd say circle's edge. Good shot. Hi, right, Brady. So I know we're both Ezra fans. Very excited that he signed with this craft. Uh, Ezra was actually the first ever pro autograph I got. I know it's disc golf, but it was still pretty exciting. I got a chance to spot at Idlewild this year. Uh, he's super nice dude. So the fact they're giving him the bean launcher nuke is definitely a good thing. Hopefully he can get out of the Prius now. Uh, yeah. Good bit. Been like just all over it, but just it needs a more beans. Ezra. <sighs> There's me again under the basket. Here's Andrew putting for two. Be more like Andrew, guys. <laughs> Shout out to Disc and Dad. I don't know if you can tell we like that place. Hi right, guys. So as we were reviewing this course. Um, I'd also like to include that this course is also where Highlands, Highlands uh, baseball team plays. Um, you can rent shelters back there. It's a really nice park. Good for walking lots of dogs here. It is a nice park. Um, but yeah, and also uh, disc golf. So, I mean, it has literally everything you need. <laughs> so, anything to add? Uh, this one look pretty? No, the... I'm having fun. I wish I didn't suck so bad right now, but these baskets make it a lot more fun, I think. They suck so much that it's enter it's entertaining. <laughs> All right, here we are at hole seven. All right, don't know how far it is. It says it's par four. It's really pretty much a part. I mean, it's par three. Nothing yeah. here is over, it was over three. So I'm just gonna throw it get away. There's a couple of holes that are over th The first hole is over 300 feet. That is a good shot with that getaway though. It needs to get left. Oh, he's in bounds. He got a little road skip though, it's spooky. <laughs> right, I'm just gonna rip it back in. Hopefully I don't throw it like a, a dumbass. I really am thinking about switching over to the flick, but my finger is so messed up right now that I can't do it. Not bad, it's riding. Ooh, good shot. Good skip, kinda coming in hot. Not bad, about 20, 30 feet. Not bad. The headwind running up on me. It's kind of a death butt. Oh, good putt, man. You needed that one. Yes, sir. Guys, hopefully I get one back on him here. He's got quite the run. Ooh. Oh no. Stop, young fella. All right. No. Hey man, good thing we're next to that dog park. Did you hear that guy? The, the dog said it was rough too. <laughs> Oh, you see, he rushed it. Yep. And just like that, folks. I don't know if that's tied up or if he still has me by one. I don't know. Well, we'll do the math later. All right, so we're here at hole eight, second to last hole. Now, if you guys can tell, this hole is exactly generally feet long. Yeah. Uh, looks like it's right over there. Yeah, if you guys are anyone from Fort Thomas or know what that signs about why he's on there you know what I could be a dumbass and that could be Ulysses S. Grant it is Grant yeah I said Robert E. Lee yeah I'm a dumbass yeah it's all right all right what are you throwing um so and then try to swing it out way way right here and then have it crash back to the left Don't need a felonious frisbee in my bag, so I'm gonna let this lady pass. Right. Ricky Wysocki out here. Uh, 
That is wide. You got enough to come back? All right, that'll do. That'll work. Andrew is going to be throwing his dynamic disc getaway. Um, I'm not sure how far away this is. I hope I threw that far enough. It's, it's a good push. I get it down there further. Uh, about 100 feet further. I'm, I'm a, okay, cool. Love playing the course is blind. That's not very good. He's going to be in the woods. Yep. Nice. Ooh, good shot. Come back. Ooh. That was looking good. Kick. That felt like a good rip. Yeah, so my Grim never came back. He's going to throw us. Who died that sexy strike? Oh my goodness. It's got blood on it. Now it's leaves. Yeah. <laughs> Go check out the Spin Dive video. Um, subscribe. Don't yeah. subscribe. We probably don't like you. So. <laughs> You subscribe. And then we'll like you. Then we'll like you. Also, you'll go learn how to make really pretty frisbees. It's a ton of fun. That's right. Oh, flip up. Keep flipping. Oh, I hit that tree. That was going to be a smash, guys. That's still a good push up there. All right, so we got Andrew down in the wood line there. Playing a little flick out. Caught a tree. He's got a little roll away there. Oh no, that one got spicy on him, ladies. How does that make you feel, dude? Hopefully the magical wizard can find the chains. Oh, brutal! Got to kind of laser this through. You guys seeing this? I saw the bird in my hand for some reason. I forgot to bring my putter, but we're gonna sink it. Next. Not good. Why does this camera make me do this? I'm gonna put mine in. It's not you guys, it's the Brody. Alright, don't know what scores were, but it was, that was kind of fun. Yeah, it was fun. Oh, it was a ton of fun. It's January disc golf, guys. It's gonna be ugly, but it's always a blast. So, hopefully, you guys enjoyed that. Sorry I didn't throw the tilt more. We're gonna come out with a dedicated review on that soon. So, yeah. This was uh, Highland Hills Park, and uh, come check it out. Pretty good course. Thank you.